the Bank of England for today's press conference uh, on the August monetary. Now, this rise in energy prices has exacerbated the fall in real incomes and so led to another significant deterioration in the outlook for activity in the UK and in the rest of Europe. The Russian shock is now the largest contributor to UK inflation by some way. There is an economic cost to the war, but I have to be clear it will not deflect us from setting monetary policy to bring inflation back to the 2% target.